we had the Tokyo Walk boys in today who phenomenal. Um, it's the first time, you know, where I think we're on week six and um, the, the gentlemen who, who come to the sessions have been uh, getting a lot out of it, but it was the first time tonight after the Tokyo Walk boys, um, they spoke and about themselves and, and what they've been through a few things. And I really noticed that um, the group really opened up and engaged today, which if I'm honest, a lot of the stuff was really emotional and this is what it's all about, you know. Um, they all left bouncing, so, you know, they, and they've said to get it, you know, to talk about it, they feel really good. Uh, Jesse's challenged them to go home with some homework and come back next week with the, uh, a few things to do. Um, I'm really proud of what we're doing and uh, I just think it's um, it's it's really good for, for all of them. Um, these guys need it. Um, and I'm happy, I'm, I'm getting a lot out of it and it's really satisfying to see what we're doing and I think everyone who's here tonight will be back here again next week. Um, look, we look forward to the sessions. I'd really look forward to them myself uh, and to bring the boys uh, add real value to what we're trying to achieve. So I just think it's, uh, it's a fantastic concept and we're really proud of what we're doing as a club. Uh, in the Don CIC, so um, long may it continue. Yeah, we've been uh, really honoured to be invited to come join other men here on you know how to build a healthy mindset uh, project you know run by Carl. And so it was such an honour just to sit down and um, see firsthand of just the many men that turn up week in week out, or just sharing their own stories, uh, realising the power of just sharing your story. Uh, brought a lot of healing uh, to the other guy, and I was just speaking to one of the other guys, Ray. He felt uh, a bit too much to share the story, right? And so when he shared today, he felt more, more confident to, to share more next time. And by him sharing it allowed everyone else to open up, and that's pretty much life here, really. Uh, a lot of times we go around with uh, hidden stories, we feel afraid to share them, but then realize, you know, our breakthrough is going to be someone else's deliverance. It's going to inspire someone down the line. And it was, it was cool because that's how we started pretty much talking about. Uh, with me, Pete, Jess and, and Q, we were literally catching up at Costa. Uh, we were just being vulnerable and sharing you know, our breakthroughs and what we're going through in life. And literally, this is what these guys done. And so to be able to just do life, man, that's turn in week in, week out. You know, no one's perfect. Um, it's okay to not be okay, and that was the message that was pushed here. So we look forward to the next um, couple of you know, episodes coming up in the next few weeks.